This is a stream. Lay a stone slab across, and you've got a simple crossing. But what if the river's too wide? That's where your engineering brain kicks in. You build stone piers in the middle, supporting smaller slabs pieced together. But strong tides and deep silt threaten the foundation. So you drop thousands of rocks along the bridge's path, creating a massive 25 meter wide, 1000 meter long causeway beneath. The piers, shaped like ships, pointed upstream to split the water and reduce hydraulic pressure. This is known as the streamlined pier method. But there's another problem. The rocks shift over time, water eroding the gaps. Your solution? Oyster farming. Oysters latch onto stone, secrete natural cement, and fill the gaps, forming a living, self-repairing concrete base. Finally, during high tide, you float the bridge deck into place using bamboo rafts. When the water drops, the deck settles exactly where it should. This technique is called the floating beam method.